Hi, I'm Louis Wasaki Meadows and welcome to Louis Stays, the series where we take you to the most interesting places that you can stay at right now in the UK. From magnificent castles to tiny tree houses, beautiful shepherd's huts to cozy cottages, I'll be showing you the very best places the UK has to offer and you can stay in them right now. But without further ado, let's get into the episode. Today we are at Pennard Hill Farm and more specifically the tree tent which is right behind me suspended from trees and also with a kitchen and a bonfire that comes with it. Okay, so first, before we show you the tree tent, we'll, we'll leave it kind of slightly later in the video, build the suspense. We have our decking area here, and it already feels like you're in some kind of fairy tale. I don't know if you've ever seen anything like this, but I definitely haven't seen anything like this. Really nicely textured with this bark down here, quite unusual. Again, you've got piles of wood, so you can light up your bonfire at night. If the weather's good, especially, if the weather's not so good, you, you might struggle, because there is no cover, admittedly. But if the weather's good, you can get your bonfire going. How good is that? How good is that? But we come down here, and what's this? Ellie asks from behind the camera. And let's have a look as we open it from these slightly fairy tale esque wooden handles. And look at this, set on wheels. So it's supposedly uh, easy to open. <laughs> and this is your kitchen. So, and not only that, it's quite spacious. And not only that, you have a four hob cooker here. You have salt, pepper, coffee, mugs, Everything you need for a self-catered experience, crockery, plates, sink, and a corrugated roof. So you are covered, you have an outdoor kitchen, you're surrounded by forestry, by nature. But even with that, you're covered, which is really good. So you don't, so you're not getting soaked, basically. You have a small seating area down there, but let's, let's keep walking through to this. As Ellie, the, Ellie said, what does this remind you of, Ellie? We need the poo, is it we need the poo's house we're coming into? Maybe. No, it's not. But it is a very nice toilet. I mean, second best, second best. Um, so we have our toilet here, and once again, you're just surrounded by wood. Wood that's actually from the surrounding area. So you are really, I mean, it doesn't get more in nature than being surrounded by the wood that is actually surrounding you. Surrounded by anyway. So we come in here, even the toilet seat, even the lid it has a wooden finish to it. You have your basin, nice metal tap, good water pressure, hot water's coming out quickly, and body wash, conditioner, shampoo, complimentary. But when are you going to use it? Because you're not going to use sh shampoo and conditioner in the sink, in the toilet. Well, 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 ladies and gentlemen, that's why this is here. The waterfall shower, outdoor shower. I mean, Admittedly, if it's cold, you might not be rushing to come out here, but if it's nice weather, even if it's slightly chilly, you can, you know, you're surrounded by wood once again. One thing I'd like to mention is that this is slightly diagonal, you know, this is slightly diagonal as well, but it's not meant to be perfect. It's not supposed to be perfect, and that's part of it. Really solid. And you have your mirror actually here as well, big mirror. I think the only mirror in this whole place. So. As we come up, Ooh. you have your seating area here, so you can sit, maybe have breakfast, maybe have dinner, maybe have lunch, maybe have a chat, maybe have a read, who knows. Come down here and, first of all, I'd like to mention this bridge before we enter. This bridge, it does feel like you're walking across a valley or something like that, and it's not quite the river, the waterfall underneath, but it's forestry all around. Really sturdy. You don't feel like you're going to, you know, fall into the forest, but you have these suspended by cables, very solid. And first of all, the exterior of this tree tent. It's beautiful. Canvas here with this dark green, with that little chimney up top. What's that for? We're about to find out. As we come inside, first of all, quiet. Windy outside, but in here, silent, isn't it, Ellie? 
it's really, really quiet. Second thing is, and there are a few things, but second thing is how well insulated it is. It's so much warmer in here than it is outside and we haven't lit a fire or anything. So that just shows how well insulated it is. It's thick on the outside, it's, it's really thick. The third thing is this skylight. It is, the light is flooding in, the windows as well. So you can just imagine laying here at night, looking at the stars and eco-friendly this place is. We have our lights here, illuminates this place. Really clever, solar powered. You've got your USBs here and this sofa pulls out to become a bed so you can lay there and look at the stars or you can sit there if it's a rainy day it's probably a nicer nicer environment to sit in here rather than be out there and there is storage space so underneath here if i open these up you have two of these on either side you have a small dressing table on that side as well and over here we have the smallest wood fire i have ever seen so if we open this little door here you get some wood in there, make sure it's small, because if it's, if it's of any size, it won't be burning in there, it'll be jutting out. So you have your little wood there. That's, I mean, it's nice to have. It does keep you surprisingly warm, even though the insulation by itself is so good. And the last thing is these windows. It'd be nice to, <laughs> it'd, be, it'd be nice, it'd be nice to open them, you might be thinking. <laughs> as I struggle to find the zip. And you actually... <laughs> Here we are. You actually can open them. So you can look out into the forest. There's a nice breeze. You can have that coming in if it's warm. Don't forget, trees are good. All this wood is from the surrounding area. All the bark, all the timber, everything. And it's just so well done. Last thing, let's give it a check. Sturdy as anything, isn't it, Ellie? Sturdy as anything, but I probably wouldn't do it too much because you might fall out the trees. Thank you for watching this video. Like, subscribe, comment to help me out. And we've got so much more coming up in store. Actually, leave in the comments if there's anywhere that you think we should visit next. And we'll see you in the next video. You can, you know, get ready for whatever you want to do in the morning, in the evening. If you, oh God. <laughs> <laughs> let's keep going, let's keep going, let's keep going. Okay, okay, so, but these are actually solar panelled. <laughs> the smallest open fire, oak wood fire, wood oven, no, it's not wood stove. Over here, tiny little wood, oh God, what is it? Wood, wood fire, wood fire. Thank you for watching this video. If no, thank you for watching this video. If you like it, leave a like. If you subscribe, <laughs>